Oh, way. He cut off uh, good fielding. They come back for three. Blessing Mawiri it was who made the gather and just flicked it back to Terry Duffin who followed him in one motion. This is a good bit of fielding. That came off the splice, so it wasn't great in terms of power or timing, but uh, this is useful. Duffin's followed him. Rainsford must not do it to lose his cool now. It's going to be a press up. I think he had more words with Nafi after he hit that shot. I think it's a concentrated on the next ball. He got a ball. Rainsford asking for his fine leg to go back on the boundary. largest partnership opening partnership by the Bangladeshis during the series they're looking for a 50 it's 48 well lost in the 11th and Sharia Nafiz has been pretty solid throughout the first one day better very well criticism that he was a little bit slow but it was a big knock and a couple of uh, failures and the last two one days he's batted well again They've just opened the face of this one and run it away. Oh, that's good fielding. Good fielding by Alton Chikambura. He certainly saved the boundary there. And 50 for Bangladesh, the highest opening stand thus far in the series. For Bangladesh. Intentionally placed there. Third slip would have been interested. But of course you have no one in that position here. Chukabur has done well because if he'd carried the ball or held the ball as he went through to make the stop, he would have gone over the ropes and it would have been four. Not straight on the ground, that's four more. Good shot. 54 full without loss. I'll tell you what. At punishing, small man or not, too short, latches onto it and plays it so well, hitting it down, making sure there's no opp no opportunity to catch the ball. Four more. Run rate achieved 4.4 by Bangladesh and no wickets lost there certainly have the upper hand wide open spaces now the field set defensively One. and cleverly nudged onto the onside there's no mid wicket in pace he's got to have to hurry oh Brendan Taylor I think has dropped the ball yes and it's just signal out of your picture to the umpire Ian Howell who asked for a an adjudication by the TV umpire to say, no, don't bother, don't waste your time. Just one away from a hundred partnership as an opening stand. Out, got him, what a catch. Prospo Sayers flighted one up and Rajin Sully, thinking he could go over the top, smashes one back. And Utea with lightning reflexes, plucks it at the air. Fantastic stuff. What a catch. So Bangladesh lose their first wicket. It's Rajan Sully. Gone for 37 of 58 deliveries. And 99 for one. Quite a little atmosphere here at the Arari Sports Club. Bit of face painting going on. Return for 99 for one it's a 21.2 overs it's been a long wait for the Zimbabwean biggest opening partnership of the
tournament so far. Uttab Ahmed walks to the wicket. 800 runs to his name, average of exactly 25. And this is why he's here. He has cracked it and Prosper Say has taken a very good catch, great reaction, and he's happy. I bet he is happy. Prosper Say dropped the fees when he was six. The fees led the wicket with 57. After Ahmed walked to the crease and gets his first run. That's a hundred up for Bangladesh. Only chasing 198. Great shot. That is Shayer Nafiz at his best. Moves to 66. Just pounced under the front foot. Blessing Mawire coming around the wicket to him. It's right in his area. He doesn't even have his helmet on anymore. Just slaps it through the covers. Virginia extra cover a bit off. Moves to 111 for one for all those superstitious out there. Well, bold. Miss everybody. Brendan Taylor could have perhaps been a chance if he had taken it up to Ahmed. Could have maybe been stuffed. It's been signaled by his by umpire Barber. This is good bowling by Prosper Say. He's absolutely foxed him. It's slower through the air and hasn't turned. Too good for after Ahmed and too good for Brendan Taylor. He's just beaten them both. Would have been a something charm. Yeah. Confusion altogether. And the Zimbabweans have messed up another chance. That is just poor cricket all around. And we spoke about the chances can come if they create something. I would have changed the field placing. There are two men only in the ring on the offside when after bomb is facing. Just locked it down to the simple chance. Just had a take and pop up the top of the drops the ball. And another chance goes begging this. Two chances and two balls. And Bob, you're going to be made to pay for that. Hamilton Mazakat is taking up the attack from the city ground in. Bowling leg spinners now. They don't seem to be helping much. He's bowled wa only one over. He's gone for six runs and he's ne very next ball. Too short. <laughs> Just gets <laughs> helped around by the fees. <laughs> Picks up four <laughs> to. <laughs> His fine leg position moves under 73. Ah! Umpire Ian Howell calls for that. Brendan Taylor's whipped off the bail. Not sure. I don't think he can see. Umpire Russell Tiffin will be the man to make the decision. Oh, he might well be out there. Not out the call. Out is the call. Stop your innings. The red light. The fire Russell Siffin's given it. If that was me, I don't know if I would. Either way, up to Barmed's walking off. Sam Taylor. Bolded Taylor. Crowd are loving it. There's a long, long wait. An anxious one. And for up to Barmed, the 24 minutes. He's gone for six, 128 for two. Ah! Second ball Hussein is the new batsman. His first game of the series. Thing is, you've got to say that one has just tickled around for one. We've got a nucleus of a team now. We've won a series here. Both for me, the other bowlers. The fee stroked it. If it gets past Ireland, it won't. 
He was always going to go to his hundred there, but Anthony Island has saved it and stopped Nafiz going to his hundred. Still a career best at this stage. Nafiz after the off jump when he's when he's hitting the ball to the off side, he doesn't bring his bottom hand, which is his right hand, uh, his left hand, into play. But when he does it to the leg side, the bottom hand comes into play. That's when he tries to force it. True. Good observation there. He's certainly played well today. Often left-handers do bring the right hand. Uh, that's not left hand too, too quickly. That's why it plays off to the leg side. There's an interesting fielding change. On the left side. Terence Daffin has moved into mid-wicket and Stuart Masikineri moved on out to deep square leg. Four men in the ring on the offside. Trying to prevent Nafiz, to be the fourth Bangladeshi to get it. One eight, nine, one. Well, well, make him think. Just thinking it might be all the way up there. You can play some more test tactics here. Don't have to be pitching the ball up. And Shows that's the mark of a guy who's bowling well. Look at the way he's, he's controlling his bowling. Once the ball short, the ball is short. Changing length at any given time. Not just spraying it all over the place. Not having the control of the ball. Knowing what to do with the ball. Most important thing. Batson played it well. Got his hands down and out of the way. Maybe another bounce on off here. The P slaps it through. It's going to go all the way to the boundary. Nobody on cover. And the 100 is celebrated. Hands aloft. He becomes the fourth Bangladeshi to get a one-day international 100. Embraces Chucky Vassan. That is the biggest inning that we've witnessed so far in this Bank of Holland 2006. And the wounds will somewhat be covered of the series defeat. Good sportsmanship from Brendan Taylor, who himself helped him his team to a victory. Well done, Sharon Nafiz. Very well played. That's one thing we've been lacking the whole series. One top order batsman. Batting all the way through the inning. thing that we haven't seen good point the top order batsmen haven't uh, really helped their team through the middle orders have been the ones to score the runs good thing about this is that the teams can learn and get better from here first hundred after getting 250 plus five times going to be edge. It's going to be a tough chase for the man at third man. Not going to win it. Four more and Ed's range but looks very disappointed as well he should be. Unlucky. Can't quite defend that. And even more runs for Sakibul Usain. 28 he moves to, or 45 balls. The second four to end. Hamilton Mazakats is over. 187 for two. And bless him, we're in. Dispatched back to the city end for four. That's a good shot from a guy who's playing well. He turned the up. Loosener, as they call it. There we go again. He's that on the up. That's a good shot. Put not across though, but good hands. Look at those hands. That's a good shot. A lot of people just call that a slap. Not got his foot to the ball. His hands have just gone through it. Could be the end of the game yet. Not quite. 
quite a few people were getting excited there. Bangladeshi fans will have something to be happy about. Bangladesh coach Deb Watmore flanked by uh, the two Pauls. will be very proud of this victory. For public out there, the, the two Pauls are the assistant coach and the uh, physio.